Greetings! In this video, I want to discuss about how to get rid of those pesky bed bugs, also known as the Cymax lectularius. And it's a little brown insect that multiply like crazy, and the females will lay eggs and they spread from the curtains to the bed to luggage, everywhere from apartments to condos and even homes and you don't know how to get rid of them. Primarily what most people do is they'll use chemicals or sprays or traps and they think that that'll get rid of them and sometimes they do. You can try to be super neat and clean and vacuum your floor once a day and then make sure you clean the window sills and protect yourself but even that won't get rid of a lot of bed bugs. Now one reason why I got a piece of luggage here because it's very common for you to go to a hotel, your family, or you're going on a business trip and all of a sudden you realize you just brought back luggage that has bed bugs in it. Or unbeknownst to you, you find out later that you did. Unfortunately, what happens is, is the bed bugs will be, uh, larva will be actually, the eggs will actually be produced on the carpet. And what will happen is, is it'll spread to your luggage. They'll migrate to your luggage and you don't even know it. You take it home and all of a sudden you've got a, a bed bug infestation. And so it's pretty easy to tell if you've got bed bugs, you'll have like little red dots, especially on your arms or on your back. And a lot of people who go to hotels and travel around will get those bed bugs. So I want to show you how you can get rid of them, not only in your home, your apartment, your condo, your house, but also in the hotel as well. So one thing you can do is when you go on vacation is plug one of these up in the wall and just do a regular power outlet and put your luggage right beside it. And that will deter the bed bugs from getting into your luggage. One little tip, the bedspread itself, usually it has like a decoration of flowers and stuff that they set on top of the blanket. And the blanket itself is not required by law in the United States to be clean after every visit. So usually the blanket and the bedspread is only clean maybe once a month. Yes, unfortunately. It's the sheets and the pillowcases that are clean every visit. So remember, whenever you touch a bedspread or a blanket, just remember probably 20 or 30 families may have been on that bedspread before. So you have to be very mindful when you go into a hotel room. Ultrasonic pest repellent. And you could use these things to get rid of insects, bugs, ants, palmetto bugs, termites, even rodents, squirrels, rats, mice. But they're very, very good on bed bugs. And what you do is the infected area that you have them, that you expect them, or you're trying to prevent from having it, you just simply plug into your wall. And what will happen is, It'll send off a vibration that only the bugs can hear, and you won't hear it. Now, if you go up real close to it, you'll hear like a little click, like a click, click, but it's not loud enough to keep you awake, and you won't even notice it. So I have one of these in my kitchen to get rid of like palmetto bugs in my living room, in my bathroom, and if I travel on vacation or if I travel to a hotel, I'll plug actually a couple of these up on the wall. Now you can get these anywhere. You can get them at Walmart, you can get them at Home Depot, Amazon, eBay. I'll put a link to this specific one that I got off of eBay. But again, you can get any pest repellent and they're also safe to be around dogs and cats and, and birds. The only thing that you can't have around, of course, are gerbils and, and rodents because they, get, they deter rodents and you can't have them around snakes. But they're fine around cats, dogs, like I said. Now, one thing you can do is maybe quarantine your luggage and maybe even the dirty clothes if you still have them and just leave them like in the garage and actually put a, a pest repellent, plug one of these up and actually set your luggage and your dirty clothes next to the pest repellent and that will deter and drive the bed bugs crazy and make them leave. And so and they'll, hopefully they'll go away from your home. So the ultrasonic pest repellent, what it does is it's like a gigantic sledgehammer into the insect's environment. that only they can hear, and they can't stand it. Yes, yeah, sometimes it will kill them, but sometimes it just annoys them like crazy, and they will get as far away as possible, and hopefully they'll go somewhere else, maybe into the, to the next apartment unit, or maybe back into the ground is preferable. If you show indications that you do have bed bugs in your bedroom or in your home, one thing you can do, like I said, is you can plug one of these up in the wall next to your bed, or better yet, actually get like an extension cord like this, plug it up, and actually lay it underneath your bed. And so what happens is when you do that, what's going to happen is the vibration will actually go up to your bed and will deter the insects even more and make them go away from your bed, which is what you want. All right, make sure you like this video, make sure you subscribe, and I'll make sure I put in the comment section where I got these specific ultrasonic pest repellents 
But again, you can get them at Home Depot, Lowe's, or Walmart, or online in general. I appreciate you watching. Let me know if you have an infestation of bed bugs, and let me know where, uh, where they're located at and where you think you got them from.